What's up, my friend? Welcome to this amazing day, my friend. It's rainy, but you're alive, my friend. You got the best victory of them all, my friend. So you got to have a gratitude session with God, my friend. It doesn't matter the external circumstance, my friend. As long as you're stable internally, my friend, you won. So you got to have a gratitude session with God, my friend. Then you got to put on your amazing. Because even though it's raining, you still got to accomplish some things this way. And you want to represent yourself the right way. So make sure you come out here as your best possible self. Because you already know when you're your best self, everybody wins. But, but when you're not your best self, everybody loses, my friend, including you, right? We're going to continue with the same thing, my friend. I'm going to give you another tool today. So you can win this new year. See, here's the thing. Anybody successful or at a place that you want to be in life, it's because they've mastered the small things, my friend. That's why I'm here to tell you, you got to master the small things, my friend. See, here's the thing. See, the goal, the goal is to master the small things in your life. The goal is not to ignore the small things. The goal is not to procrastinate over the small things. The goal is not to push past the small things, to ignore the small things in your life, my friend. But here's the hard truth. That's exactly what most people do. Most people actually ignore the small things in their lives and then they wonder, right? Why they can't gain consistent momentum in and throughout their lives. Well, go figure. It's all about the small things. Here's the hard truth, right? Evidence of both success and the lack thereof can all be traced back to how well we handle the small things in our lives, my friend. Your success depends on how well you can master the small things in your life, my friend. This life is about self-mastery. Here's three reasons. Why you gotta become more urgent about the small things in your life, my friend. Number one, here's the thing. You gotta keep small problems small, right? Because if you don't, those small problems, they move up. Now they're big problems. But you're not done there. Those problems that were on the big problem show, they gotta do something too. So now, because the small problems moved up to the big problem show, the big problems that were already on the big problem shelf, now they gotta move up to the impossible problem shelf, my friend. You gotta handle those little things in your life, my friend. Number two, here's the thing. See, being a good steward over the small things in your life is evidence that you're ready to graduate, you're ready to receive bigger things in your life, my friend. And number three, here's the thing. You gotta develop a greatness mindset, yeah. A mind bold enough to believe, right? That in order to master the small things, it takes mental discipline and consistency. So, so when you can maintain mental discipline, and consistency over the micro challenges in your life. It produces macro wins, my friend. So in other words, when you can master the small things in your life with mental discipline and consistency, you're about to cash out, my friend. You're about to get to the bag. You're about to win, my friend. All because you made a commitment to master the small things in your life, my friend. And never forget, while you're out there mastering the small things, while you're being your best self, while you're being the change you want to see in the world, you were born to be great.